Alright, so let's record some video on one take. Yeah, just been watching a bunch of TV, so <laughs> this is a quick update. Don't pause the video and look at any bookmarks. So I'm pulling some footage from uh, Last Man Standing, which is Bruce Willoff. He's been very popular thanks to Red Letter Media as of late. But um, I found this movie very fantastical because... Oh, I guess we're looking at settings here. So, yeah, so I'm using the VLC player, kind of looking for the perfect frame. I want to do a nice still shot. Um, I think you do like E, E like uh, eagles on the keyboard, and you can just freeze frame as, with a frame that you want to pull from the graphic that you're going to trace. And I say trace proudly. So I think we're adjusting levels because the the inks it's just kind of too dark, so you can see it more betterly. And then I'm just moving all this trash. So that's one. That's an example of a finished product. Uh, another example of a finished product. Smack it, flip it, rub it down. And then, yeah, so this is me sending to the printer. This is my stimulus check printer. You want to call it that? I say that jokingly. Yeah, look how fast it is. But, I mean, this is on 5X. Uh, I don't know what the hell I was doing. Okay, yeah, so you need the battery charger. There's a power supply. It's just a USB. You can plug it into any power source. But I choose to keep it portable. So I use the that battery thingy for the, that reason plug it into the port of trace. I know I'm not saying it right, but it's a light box. I said box, haha. So, yeah, I'm just using a ballpoint pen at this point. I, I think I kind of lost the pen in the couch at some point. So, yeah, just tracing this uh, Bruce Willis with the uh, just good old ball pen. So, yeah, just getting in those details. Um, I'm, it's pretty self-explanatory at this point. Um, this one, I, I gotta admit, I, I did do a kind of lousy job normally because I'm used to using two hands, but um, I was being a time saver, so I was holding the camera. I have a mounted device that I could use, but I just, I didn't feel like using it because I'd look ridiculous. It reminds me of that. Alright, so what, what the hell? Yeah, so you may find it advantageous if you like flip it and then flip it and then trace on one side and then trace on the other side and keep flipping. See, so obviously... Oh, okay, so I, I guess this is an example of me using two hands. Um, this pin, it, it's kind of running out of ink, but I was purposely trying to just kind of uh, GED, get it done, get her done, her done. Um, it's kind of off focus or not, not in frame, but yeah, it's just a series of flipping. So it, it may be kind of advantageous to just I keep on using that damn word why do I keep advantageous to go through and just flip it just keep on flipping you see what you feel uh, it's not a reference to VHS from the 90s what is that whooshing sound in the background yeah so that that looks good um, I mean it's this is a really a half-hearted effort I could have put some more effort into it but um, yeah just Kind of see what you see. It it looks so so so. I I would have rather spent a little bit more time. So yeah. So we're scanning it. You just flip it, put it on the scanner. That's a really old soda that I had. I finally threw it away. Uh, that's a bag of chips that I had received, or a box of chips rather, and that's a dog. So yeah. What is that? Okay. So we're in paint paint.net. Um, scanning it uh, black and white, 400 DPI, and then just hit OK, and then just let it scan. And then it's just going to be a black and white image. Hey, bait, what's going on? Yeah, so that's the can of scanner process. Wow, juice boxes. Doing a little bit of cleanup while it's scanning. Oh, flipping it. Inversion. Oh, wow. That looks good. See? Yeah, so that's paint.net. This is probably upside down. Or right side up. Inside's out. Okay, that's the end of this here. I, I think I tried to erase the cheek or something, but I really wasn't satisfied with this anyway and I keep saying that yeah so that's the color chip right there in paint wow this is totally upside down I think this video is coming to an end I'll probably try and do something a little bit more effort involved and then um, have a great day